Well, Dr. Kroll. Yes, sir. We've turned in our homework assignment and here are the results. Good man. We got our results from the uh, soil lab. Now you need to tell us how to interpret these. Yeah, I, I usually get this call after I talk folks into collecting their soil samples and they do it well and dutifully and they send it into the lab and then they get this back. And they go, I don't understand a word they're saying here. Lots of numbers. Well, <clears throat> let me explain it to you. There are two sections. Every soil lab is gonna send you a slightly different report, but usually it's divided into two sections. At the top, they're gonna to give you what they found in, re in regards to the nutrients in your soil. And then the second part down at the bottom, they're gonna make their recommendations and tell you how much to add. So if we're looking here, they, they give you nitrogen, they give you phosphorus, and they give you potassium, that's NPK. NPK. If you buy a 13-13 fertilizer, the first 13 is nitrogen, the second one, phosphorus, the third one is potassium or potash, people call it. Okay. All right. So they give you the amounts that are in those three key elements. And then they give you a lot of micronutrients uh, and other macronutrients like calcium and magnesium and that sort of thing. And of course, magnesium is pretty important in trees a lot of times. All right. <clears throat> and they're very kind to you. They give them in parts, parts per million or percentages. But what you really need to look at is they'll tell you if that level is high, low, Right. Or very low. And so we've got some here that are very low, and we got some that are moderate and high. So that tells you a pretty good idea of, of how what the quality of that soil. But the part that you're interested in, what to do, is down at the bottom. And they'll tell you how much of each nutrient to put per acre. It's all on a per acre basis out on that, on that site. In this case, we're standing out in a deer orchard. So uh, it'll give a, a recommendation for nitrogen, a recommendation like 40 pounds per acre. Uh, phosphorus, maybe 50 pounds per acre. Potassium, maybe 30, whatever. Uh, now, and so you, you in the old days we went and went to a, to a uh, farm store and they had a deal with a fertilizer plant and you said, this is the formula that I want and then they would deliver you a ton or whatever you wanted. And hope that that was yeah. what you were asking yeah. for. And I would love it if it was that way today, but we've moved away from that. And so you're gonna get frustrated because <clears throat> say that the fertilizer says, I want, I want, they want you to put uh, 50, tw 50 of nitrogen, uh, 40 of phosphorus and 30 of potassium, okay? And you go down to the store and you tell them you need that and they just look at you. And they, hand, they say, that's what we got. And the bag says 13, 13, 13 on it. Now you turn into a mathematician. So you can't get it, you can't get there from here. So uh, if, you, if you're gonna follow the soil uh, analysis and recommendation, just go down there and buy a bag of, of nitrogen. And nowadays we can't buy ammonium nitrate like we used to because people blow things up. Right. So we usually get urea or ammonium nitrate urea as our nitrogen source, and then we can get pure phosphorus and we can get pure potash. And then we know what the percentages are in it, and you're gonna to have to do some math, I'm sorry, but you're gonna to have to get as close as you can to the formulation they recommend. So you custom mix your own. It's easy to do, you can do it in buckets. Most people are not gonna fertilize that much, uh, or you can do it, I use uh, an old cement mixer. Yeah. Just pour it in, mix it up like that, and make our own fertilizer. And if you've got big problems or intimidated by numbers, uh, you know, don't hesitate to, to get in contact with us and we'll help yeah, we'll you be, we'll be, with the analysis. If you want us to help you with your, reading your analysis, we'll be more than happy to help you. But it is important, and I know that's confusing, but it is important for you to do it right. You've invested so much in your food plot, so much in your orchard, and well, why not do everything you can? More important than the money is the time. Yeah, you you, you can't time. get it back. You can't so buy time. You, you cannot to, buy time. We want you to be successful on yep. the first run. So that's, that's our brief, hopefully not too confusing explanation of what it is. Uh, you can see that uh, we've got several copies and explanations on the website here. So maybe that'll be a little clearer to you. If it's not, reach hey, out to email us. us, reach out to us. We'll, uh, we'll help you out.